Hello friends. This is the block of Elimac generator, and we are installing its timing plate. First, we have to insert the gasket in its place. And then we have to fit the plate on it. This is the cover of the timing plate. Clean this cover in a clean cloth and then place it on the block this is the timing mark now we have fitted the plate don't forget to replace the soil seal Every time you remove this cover, you should replace the oil seal. After tightening the bolts, insert the push rods. In cam followers. Rotate the crankshaft to make sure that these push rods are going up and down. When you rotate the crankshaft, you will feel their movement slowly coming up and down. Inside there you can see the cam follows with the tappets in which these push rods are seated or fitted for rotating the crankshaft these push rods will also move up and down which will result in the movement of the walls when the head is installed don't forget to duplicate them before installation there you can see the slight movement of the push rods thanks for watching the video